Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Today I will show you how to use a VPN on school Chromebook. Now, as you can see, I found one article and this is a very good article on how to use a VPN on school Chromebook uh, the easy way. Um, as you can see, right, so uh, basically here's the summary, right? So uh, if you're using a personal device, the best way to unlock websites on school Wi-Fi is to use a VPN, right? Now to do this, you obviously need to sign up to a top rated VPN service. It can be ExpressVPN, ProtonVPN, any VPN out there, right? And then at school, you need to open the VPN app and turn it on, right? Your traffic will now be encrypted and redirected through a remote VPN server, right? Then you nav navigate to the blocked website and you should now have access to it. Now, usually if you're using a school computer, you typically won't be able to use a VPN or any other tool that needs downloading, right? So you probably won't be allowed to install a proxy extension for Google Chrome either. Instead, what you can do is you can use a web proxy to unblock websites on a school computer. Now, here's what, here's how you can do it, right? You enter URL of a web proxy into your web browser search bar, which is this proxy right here, um, you know, HMA free proxy. You can just type it in Google. And then here, as you can see, uh, you will basically get, uh, you know, website and then uh, whether or not you want to connect through a server or not, right? So uh, this can be also like a, a VPN, a, um, you know, different type of VPN, right? So for example, um, you can see that they also have pricing as well, but you can just put the address here and then you can connect with a random server, right? You can also set up, you know, uh, cookies and stuff like that, right? Um, and then you just choose the proxy server's location, right? Choose the location nearest to you for the fastest speeds and then you click connect and the website should uh, appear on your screen unblocked, right? Now, if you're using a school Chromebook, a school Chromebook sorry, the best way to bypass content restrictions will depend on how strict your school, uh, you know, has it, right? Now, that's pretty much it. You know, some Chromebooks will have a lower security, some will have higher. So depending on, uh, you know, how many limitations you have, you will be able to use VPN or you will be able to go and use the proxy as well. So um, yeah, hope that helps you out. If it did, leave a like down below, comment down below, obviously, if you have any feedback on this video and we'll see you in the next video. Thank you guys for watching.